So we're here at the beer shop in St Albans. I'm here with Roger Protz, who's a uh, beer writer and also editor of Camera's Good Beer Guide. Today we're talking about uh, a pale ale by Tring Brewery, which is called Side Pocket for a Turd. Um, Roger, tell us a little bit about the beer. <coughs> Well, it's got the most unusual name to start with, side pocket for a toad, which I'm told is an old Hertfordshire expression for something which has no use. But this beer certainly has a lot of good uses because it's a delicious beer. And pale ale is a beer style that originated in this country in the 19th century, but this is a very modern interpretation of pale ale because they're using an American hop called the Cascade, which gives a lovely resiny, piney, and above all, citrusy Mm. nose and aroma on the beer. It's really easy drinking as well though isn't it? It's got lots mm. of flavours, it's got bitterness from those Cascade hops, mm. you also get really nice aroma from the Cascade hops but it, it's really drinkable as well, it's still you know it's, it's got that traditional English bitter feel to it as well isn't it? It certainly has and the whole point of beer is got to be drinkable and this has a, has a lovely balance of lovely biscuity malt and that rich citrusy hop character as well. And it's not a very strong beer this either is no. it? No, it often surprises people from other countries who who think, why are your beers so weak? And we don't drink the strong beers of, say, Belgium or the United States, but um, we pack so much flavour into a beer with a very modest strength. Yeah, I mean, as I say, we're at the, the beer shop in St Albans, but they actually do sell draft beer here as well. So this is a, um, a cask-conditioned beer. Um, they serve it here on top. You can take away, well, as the Americans say, growlers. Um, <laughs> we'd say containers of beer and take a few pints home as well. Um, so it's, it's definitely well worth trying. Um, that's Tring, side pocket for a turd. Um, Thanks for talking about Roger. Lovely, cheers.